Hey Cal, uh, I just got done watching your video, Depression, Overwhelmed, and Being Alone, and um, I feel compelled to do a video response. Uh, I'm not sure what I'm going to say and uh, what I have to contribute to it, but I, I guess that I wanted to make a clear effort to connect with you in more than, you know, typing in words in a comment. Um, I actually haven't seen many of your videos. I've just gotten done watching um, a couple of them right now. And um, so I can't pretend to know you all that well. I don't know if you've watched any of my videos or not. Um, but but the Depression Overwhelmed and Being Alone video, um, I want to say a couple of things. Um, your feelings about your life and where you're at and what's going on and, and so forth. Um, I heard you compare them to <clears throat> other situations, you know, um, I can't actually remember what you cited, but basically, you know, other people's struggles and how those struggles may be more severe than, than what you're going through right now. And I just really want to offer to you like it, like other people have that, um, struggles, are not comparable to each other. Um, from an outsider's point of view, one might be able to look at situation A and say that it is worse than situation B, but for the people in both those situations, it's profound to themselves, and um, it, it's not something that you can compare. There's no scale that says, you know, how bad this is impacting me, um, or how much this is impacting me is more or less than how that person's being impacted by that situation. So. Um, I guess I just really want to validate and honor your feelings and where you're at and what's going on and to let you know that that even though you feel alone um, you're not and and I know that having a YouTube community for all of its wonderful things um, we are not someone to come home to and talk to on the couch or watch TV with or have you know somebody who's physically in your space to interact with um, and I get I get that, but I also want to say that for all the things that we are not, um, we are an amazingly strong, resilient group of people who um, are here for each other. Um, if we ask for the support, overwhelmingly we get it. And I feel like your depression overwhelmed and being alone video was asking for support, and so I want to offer that to you. Um, I feel like I can relate to the space that you're in, although thankfully I'm not in it right now. Um, I have felt alone and isolated much of my life and certainly have struggled with depression, continue to struggle with depression. Um, and that, you know, I'm not sure why you're moving to Salt Lake City. Um, uh, I have actually some friends that live in Salt Lake and they uh, comment often like they're not sure why they live there. So um, if you do move there, maybe I can connect you with my friends that live there. Um, but uh, whether you move there or stay where you are or do whatever, um, you know, you're going to be wherever you are, you know. So uh, being kind to yourself and validating your feelings and when you have the energy to try to create a different community or different space for yourself. I just totally encourage you to do that. Um, but uh, the idea that somehow your time for partnership has passed, um, I would want to throw out the possibility that maybe that's not the truth. Uh, we never know when someone's going to enter into our lives, where they're going to come from and the role that they're going to play. Uh, but if we forget to remain open to it, we're certainly less likely to get that than if, if we um, keep ourselves open to the possibility. So, I, I don't know, I, I feel like I'm maybe preaching to the choir or something, but um, I really wanted just to reach out and do a video response to you and let you know that um, you're not alone and um, I will be keeping an eye out for your videos and uh, watching your videos that you've already uploaded and learning more about you because I'm interested now. And uh, if you haven't already, I encourage you to check out my videos. Um,
there's actually one that I posted a while ago when I was early on into my transition where I, I was expressing a lot of feelings. I was depressed and I was sad and I was lonely and, you know, I was all of these things. And, um, and uh, the good news is, is that I'm not in that place anymore. And um, there's something to be said about where you are hormonally also within your transition. And um, it's huge and it takes a huge toll on us. And so try to remember that also. Um, I'm trying to look at the name of the video actually of that I did where uh, it's called Appreciation and um, gosh I uploaded it November 17th 2008 it was a lifetime ago wasn't it um, so check it out if you're interested if not that's totally cool and uh, um, yeah I guess I will uh, look forward to new videos from you and, and getting to know you a little bit better